With snow in the future forecast, Jefferson City and Cole County Public Works have started the work to create safe environments for drivers. ABC 17's Ethan Hines is in Jefferson City where he spent the day finding out how both departments operate and clear roads. Ethan, how are they planning for the up incoming snow? Lucas, both departments spent a little bit of time making sure that they're ready for the snow, whether that's checking their gear or coming up with an action plan of what roads to clear and how often they have to be cleared. Cole County Road Supervisor Brian Boyce says there are 23 plows in service ranging from big trucks that hit main roads to smaller pickups that cover residential areas. We have right at 470 miles of road um, and we try to prioritize all of our paved roads first which we have right at 330 miles of paved. So evenly distributing 23 trucks gets us through a route in a 12-hour shift several times. Boyce wants residents outside of Jefferson City's limits to lend a helping hand to crews on the road by parking off the road if possible. If you can park in your driveway, please park in your driveway. It makes it very difficult for our plow trucks to navigate through the street uh, if cars are parked out there. Russell Rackers is the Jefferson City street manager and has all the snow equipment ready for snow. According to him, all drivers have gone through their routes already and are prepared if anything is out there that may be a surprise. They've all gone through their trucks to make sure they're all ready to go and that there isn't it, and anything that's broken since the last time we've had a snow event. 25% of the workers in plows within city limits are new, so Rackers says it's important to give them adequate space and be patient while they work. Now both departments want people to realize that it's better to stay off the roads when there's a lot of snow and if something could wait like an errand, it's better just to wait. Reporting from Jefferson City, Ethan Hines, ABC 17 News. Thank you, Ethan. According to an assistant chief with the Jefferson City Fire Department, if you're driving and come across a car with yellow caution tape, it means it's already been looked over by emergency personnel and there's no need to call it in.